a yes. healthy church is a safe place, you know, um, mm. and, and, and a healthy church does not mean everybody that goes to the church is healthy. <laughs> come on, come, come on, Say that again. come on. Come a healthy on. church is, is there to open up their arms to the sick, to those who are yes. hurting. So, mm -hmm. you know, everybody, you're not going to get along with everybody in church. I think church is a place that a healthy church will refine you or a healthy church mm -hmm. will mm -hmm. allow you to go through trials and tribulations so that you can become more like Christ, you know. But but for me, it's a safe place. It's a place that you can be who you are because the Holy Spirit will, will make you more like him, you know? Um, mm -hmm. and, and I think it should be a family. I think a healthy church is like a family. Uh, families don't, we all know, we all come from families. We don't get along all the time. <laughs> but you know out. what? We're family. <laughs> We're family. And when we approach, I think a healthy church is a church that is, is, is a family and you, and you treat one another with love and respect but also you're, you're willing to, um, I think Anita said, to be consistent and stay in there. I think so many times mm -hmm. we, we leave churches so quick because it's not what we want it to be. Yeah. And uh, you talked about that earlier, Hosanna. Um, but, but if everybody you know, left when, when something goes wrong, then, then you're never going to be planted. You know, in order to mm -hmm. be healthy, you have to be planted somewhere. You know, mm -hmm. and so I think a healthy church is about security is safety, but also it's a place that um, you have to accept everyone for the way they are. Can we go back for a moment to I, I love what you said, Stephanie, about this idea of being Christ like, because, um, you know, I work I work in the technology sector. And one of the things that has always amazed me uh, when I think about technology and ministry is that for the longest time, people defined church as a place you go, mm -hmm. as a program you watch, um, as a thing you do. And it boggled my mind because as I searched the scriptures and as I looked at the life of Jesus, I never saw him put his name on a place. I never saw him say, you know, hey, I have this amazing parable that I want to share with you, but come see me at the temple this weekend and it's going to be amazing. Bring your friends, bring your family. Like right. he, he never did that. What he did is he imparted wisdom right where people needed it. He prayed for them right where they needed it. He, he performed miracles and healing right where they needed it. And so I think over this last year, what people have hopefully come to realize realize is that the church has never been a place that you go. It has always been a community of people. Yeah. Um, the church is you. It's me. It's us. You know, we carry uh, the body of Christ and the Great Commission everywhere that we go. And so I think part of being a healthy church is being a church that models Jesus. Jesus mm -hmm. took his power everywhere that he went. He didn't reserve it for a special program. <laughs> and I think that's the, the charge and the challenge for us to be healthy. I love, I love what you just said, uh, Nona, um, cause I think it's so true and hopefully we can help people today. Um, I don't know, for some reason, people take Christianity as something that happens on Sunday morning. Mm -hmm. And it's like you said, it's a lifestyle and it's being like Jesus all of the time. You know, it's not just on Sunday and Friday or Wednesday, whenever you're, but it's, it's, it's becoming who he is, it's becoming like him. And, um, I think that is so huge because when you take it from there, I think then you're quicker to see what Hosanna said and, and understanding that you're a part of the church. It's the yes. people we make up the yes. church. If you don't like your church then you got to look at you <laughs> and oh, say, what's word. going on with me? <laughs> what am I bringing to the table? If everybody was like me, what kind of church would this be? You know, and even if you're the best of the, the best in serving God, it would still be an unhealthy church if everybody was like you. At TBN, our mission is to use every available means to reach as many individuals and families as possible with the life-changing gospel of Jesus Christ. Thank you for helping make the gospel of grace go around the world. And it's because of you that partner with us that this ministry continues. God bless you.